Hello, welcome. I'm Linda West. I'm going to be answering your questions uh, about the angels, about what's happening on the planet, about why things are so chaotic right now. Um, any of the questions that you may have that are in general, how the angels feel about abortion, how the angels feel about gay people, how do the angels feel about so if you are interested, please send an email. You can go to my website, lindawest-medium.com, or you can um, write here on YouTube. But today's question, the one I'm going to be answering is, does each and every one of us have guardian angels around us? And that's a pretty easy one for me because I do angel readings. And when I do those readings, I am connecting with your uh, guardian angels. And yes, each and every one of us have guardian angels. I've actually seen three around some people, two, um, and occasionally a person has one. But if I see that one, they're usually very large, very huge wingspan, uh, lots of very potent energy if you just have one guardian angel. The, your relationship with your guardian angels, they watch over you, they're close to you no matter what. The problem that most people have in regards to angels or spiritual help or any of those things is we keep ourselves separate. We oftentimes will try to accomplish things on the planet, uh, in our lives, difficulties that come up. We do that on our own. Yeah, yeah, there's a big God up there, but... Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, there's angels up there, but why would they take any time to be with me? Um, this seems to be a real common denominator for people in connecting or not connecting with angels. What I have found, which makes it really cool and simple, <laughs> we like things to be simple. The angels like things to be simple, and I've learned over the years that Wow, I really like things to be simple, and I'm sure you feel the same way, is that all you got to do is call them in. The angels can help you if you don't ask. Since we all have angels around us and have that capability to make that connection, it's really, really, really important that you ask. Angels, take care of this. Angels, guide me today. Angels, make this a wonderful, happy day. And allow yourself to just let go. Detaching. Yeah, that's a whole other subject, but we will get to that in another video. But today, yes, you do have guardian angels. And if you want to know the names of your guardian angels, because they, I used to get when I, um, clients would, all, clients always ask, what are the names of my guardian angels? And uh, the neat part about that is that I've been instructed not to tell you the names of your guardian angels anymore. You need to just ask, okay, angels, what's your names? and you will get that information and then you can start that personal relationship having that divine help in your life and move towards more freedom more joy isn't that the whole thing more empowerment yes that is the whole point thank you write in with your questions i'll be happy to answer them